Okay, so today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a World of Warcraft 3.3.5-12340 build private server. Um, first off, I did not make this repack. I'm just using it and showing you guys an example. Um, this is the original page which I found it from, and it works. Works fine. Nothing wrong with it that I see. Extremely scripted, but uh yeah basically you're just going to go to go to this page which will be everything will be in the description and you're going to want to download it download the links right here um, it also has a link up here for Microsoft Framework 3.5 which is what you're going to need to run the server and this is what it is basically it's completely trusted it's Microsoft you can just download it from this page too but uh basically I already have it downloaded so I'm not going to download it um, basically you're just going to want to find your repack and you have to have WinRAR link for that will be in the description as well and you're going to want to extract it to wherever you want to extract it to like I'm going to extract mine to the 3.3.5 example is I made this folder to show you guys and as you guys can see it's extracting and everything um, but I'm not going to make you guys watch all that but once it's done it'll look like this and from this you're just going to want to open tools, go to map extractor copy this AD go to your World of Warcraft icon on your desktop click open file location and then paste it in here. Once it's pasted in there, you're going to want to click, right click, new folder, call it maps, and then you're going to want to click AD. It's going to extract every map from the game into that folder right there. And it'll make the server a lot more stable. It's not 100% necessary, just makes it a lot more stable and then you're going to want to do the same thing with the database extractor. I don't even do this one because it doesn't matter at all. So, um, In the folder there is a GM helper for your game master commands and your administrator commands. You're, it's going to be in here. It's an add-on you can import along with RKMU. There's a RKMU GM commands thing in here. There's RKMU correct which is just LUA scripts and SQL updates like brew test and stuff and then you've got in here Apache is what you'll use to put it on the web and you'll be able to have people register there um, I'll make a tutorial on how to bring your private server online eventually but it probably won't be today I don't know but while that it's will take a good 30 minutes to extract, 30 minutes to an hour. Um, but once it's done, I'll just show you guys really fast. You're going to want to open MySQL, and then you're going to go to RKMU, log on server, and then you're going to want to go RKMU world, and just let it do its thing. Load up, just minimize all this. Um, like I said, it's not 100% necessary to keep this, to have this. I'm just letting it go as I go. And once that's over, you're going to want to open back up your World of Warcraft file and delete your cache. Completely wipe it from your computer. Um, once that's done, go to its allow access thing at the firewall and just go into data in US and this realmless.wtf file right click and click well it's not there just click open and if it won't open click select a program from the list of installed programs click OK and click notepad or come up with this with this you're going to want to make a new folder or well, a new text document in this and name it Retail Realm List. That's 
what I'm going to call mine because it's how you get back on retail wow you're going to want to open it and you're going to want to copy what's in this realm list into the retail realm list and paste it and click save um, then after that you're going to want to delete everything in here I set realm list 127.0.0.1 and that's all you want in there click exit save and then that's it. Then you're just going to want to exit out of this. Once this stuff is loaded like it has right now, you're just going to want to bring up WoW. This is going to look really, really shitty on Hypercam. But, yeah. Once it's loaded, hold up. Um, I better mute my volume. Oh, shit. Give it a minute to load because I'm running a bunch of shit. Mm -hmm. Alright, so once while it's loaded, you're going to want to type in admin, admin. And it should bring you up to your private server. 